welcome back to the channel and this is an updated video for this lab so first of all just start your lab and if you are using a windows machine that time you have to just download this ppk file and if you are using a mac or chrome os that time you have to just download this pm file just simply click on that and the file will download to your local system automatically i already downloaded this file once you're done with this now just simply scroll down and here you can see for connecting to vm if you have the windows machine that time you have to use the putty and if you have the mac os then you can use the terminus okay now you can download this software from app store once you're done with all this stuff now just simply come over here and copy this external ip click on this create host and paste the external ip over here now copy your username and here you can see username just paste over here now click on this set a key click on new key and click on import key and just upload that key which should just download it click on open just wait for a second click on save it will be reload and it's done now click on this arrow and double click over here wait for a second and now click on continue it will take a couple of seconds meanwhile just simply click on the task debug the issue now just simply copy the first command wait for a couple of seconds and it's connected now run the first command then scroll down copy the second command run over here then copy the third command and run now please pay attention guys because this is a very important command okay now copy this command and run over here now once you run this command you can see this first row and here you can see this pid number it is a process id and just remember this number 2638 for you it might be different so just remember that number because we need that number in later step okay now just simply scroll down copy this command and run over here now again scroll down copy this command and run over here now here you can see we have to just change the process id what is the process id I will let you know now just let me just show you how to copy this now copy from here to here make sure that after kill there must be one space so just copy this paste over here you can see this is a space now if you just simply come over here you can see this PID number and this is a process ID and make sure you have to just copy this thing like 2638 not that slash 30 python 3 okay just copy this thing or you can just simply type over there okay now just paste 2638 and hit enter once you're done with this now again scroll back and copy this command and run then again scroll back copy this command and run okay now again scroll copy this run now copy this command and run now copy this command and this is the last command of our lab so just run over here and if you get this kind of error I saw many of you guys facing this kind of error. No need to worry about that. Just rerun the command now, once again. Okay, just copy this command and rerun again. And here you can see we again got a same error. No need to worry about that. And I am glad that I faced this error so that I will let you know how to resolve this error. Just wait for a couple of minutes and again rerun this command. Okay, and here you can see after two tries I got no error. As you can see and if i just come back over here and click on the check my progress i will get the score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day